What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2023 Bowman Chrome Baseball Hobby Edition just sold out. Uh, 12 box case break pitching number three. Well, see, the difference between Rodgers and Jalen is that Jalen's going to get rushing touchdowns on top of passing. <laughs> if you drafted Rodgers this year, Bobasito, feel bad for you. Alright, here we go guys. 12 total boxes right there. Oh, that's not gonna happen. Well, if they score a touchdown. Oh, then it'll be six or less? Oh, it'll be exactly six. Yeah. If they score a touchdown, I, st I don't even, I still win because they were down by six at half. Oh my god. Cut the legs up. Oh, I hope the Jets win. <laughs> hey, so that promo ended today at 6? I thought it was Friday. It's wild. It's not enough time. Well, luckily we pulled nicer ones over there. <laughs> Imagine we would pull like uh, Salah's 101 over here. <laughs> we wouldn't have been able to be part of it. I wonder if like even that orange auto or even... Well, yours, that's pretty expensive, probably. Yeah. It's probably more expensive than the Michael Harris, but I don't know what would be more popular, though. But I honestly don't even know what other people have pulled, so... I, I think we'll if see. we have the lowest number solace, I think we might win. Yeah. <laughs> but if someone pulls a red or something, then yeah, we have. Also, like, the pulls have to be this match right? So that's what I'm saying, yeah. That lowers the... Because uh, people are ripping everyone else. So. <clears throat> yeah. Wow, well, Logan, you're dreaming big, bro. Packers and Eagles in the championship game? I'm thinking it one game at a time, Logan. I'm not thinking that far ahead. <laughs> dreaming big, bro. <laughs> Something crazy has got to happen for that. No, but no, I mean, fumbled it. <laughs> there goes your points. If it is holding for them. <clears throat> Who hit the salt over there? Was it Sun Coast? Oh, yeah. Sun Coast. Looked like they did. They might have been a free play. Oh, yeah. Oh, I got lucky. You might just win. You might just win something. Oh, offsides. Terry, we're talking about guys lining up in neutral zone. It's more of a play with it's just now than it used to be. It is. They, they, they really wanted to start the play. They played, you know, you look at it, it's clearly in the neutral zone. I, I 
I don't know, man. For so many years, you guys were the top dogs up there, but it's Lions country, baby. The Lions, I think, are going to make people look silly over there. And then Minnesota, obviously, would still be okay. Because uh, they want to be one of the top seeds, they need the dubs. I mean, I think you guys are going to go for an onside right now. Because there's no way you guys are just going to let the Eagles run the ball. So, onside, if it doesn't happen, then I think the game's over. They have two timeouts left. But they're not just going to let the Eagles just like run the ball in the sense that, like, they're gonna have to onside it to even give them a real chance. <clears throat> no, I didn't, I didn't. I don't. I don't know if the Bears got any on or not. <clears throat> but yeah, Ted. You know what? You guys. You guys messed up. You guys should have been able to beat the Tampa Bay Bucks. See, if you guys would have beat the Bucks. <laughs> then this game wouldn't have mattered so much, you know? So you'd be going into it one and one you know? Potentially. I'm like behind guys, so don't tell me if they got it or not. I might actually have to see it from over here. Alright, they're going for it guys, let's see. That TV over there on the outside is like 15 seconds ahead of mine. Fumble the ball. That's all that needs to happen. 
Sandra Lacuna for the Rangers. Number 150. C plus B minus football. And yes, they're two of them. Yes. You know, if they put it together, think about how dangerous they can be. Very happy if they look at the two games. They're not pretty. Lock the board on. Three to two. Yeah. 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 Wow, another relic? Two relics, how about this? Kumar Rocker. Out of 10. Keeps to the base. There's always room on the wagon, Ted. Always room. That's right, Ted. Jump on the Thunder Wagon this year, too, for basketball, Ted. SGA gonna have another MVP year this year. Hopefully Chet's healthy, which he should be. J Dub. Woo! Alright, here we go guys. First six. Tell me what. Pooch wanted. Luis Torres. Two ninety nine. Ethan Salas. <laughs> You're not that frustrated. <laughs> We got uh, you. Woo. Luis Guanipa for the Braves. Jeremy Port. Blaze Jordan. Brett Beatty. So one desperate prayer. Out of 100. Which they had answered when they played the Buffalo last year. Remember that game? Yeah. Well, you know, you know, Justin. And Justin Henry Malloy. He's one of their top prospects for the Braves. Another one for Sport Port. There you go, man. You're setting up the, the different laterals to try to throw the ball back, just keep the play alive here. We can activate Case Keener for the Minnesota River. Logan Ahapi to 499. Might be the final play of the game, barring a defensive foul. But before that, folks. And nice, Janner Miller. 
at a 150. Robert Moore for the Brewers. Brewers that's going to Josh Allen. Delgado for the Yanks. Vargas, gold to the Dodgers. Out of 50. And Tristan Casas, Bowman Ascension, case hit. Nice. Red Sox going to Joseph. <clears throat> and Luis Torres for the Angels. Blue Ray Wave. Brady House. CJ Abrams. Hang in there. Carissa and the gang all set. The ramp things up to Philadelphia Association Penny. Post game show. Cutting your way on the other side. And we got Javier Valdez. A little speckle to 299 first for the Braves. Braves having a solid break to start off. <clears throat> Bobby Witt. Miller. There we see the Los Santos. Jeff Walker. Crazy part is that I would never be playing today and game. Stop. That's the truth, right? I have that. This is your 12th season. Is it your last? Drew Gilbert. Brooks Lee Gold. Out of 75. Serta. You got Cabrera. Blue. I would like him to retire when he will still be able to get on the floor and play with our kids and all the boys. Rizzo. Green. 299. And Vladimir for the Rockies. Gonzalez. Samuel Munoz. Out of 75. 499 Montgomery. Marlins. Brooks Lee. Blues Rest. Cook. Athletics. Los Santos. So sure, big picture takeaways from this game. You wake up in the morning, you see a score of 34-28, but it didn't feel that close. 
close, but, but if you just think about what if. What if the Justin Jefferson fumble before the half, that was a touchback. The what ifs, the what ifs, the what ifs. This is a six point ball game. That was a touchdown. He was walking in and you dropped the ball. I just felt like Minnesota is going to regret that all season long. That's the Joey Ortiz. Ortiz. For the 75 for the Orioles. Andy. Your passing game is struggling. You find a way. We're going to run it, run it, run it. Shreel. You got to bounce up in this list. You lost the game, bro. What are we going to do? We're going to go win that. All right, by committee. They didn't need to. Swift had his best. Yeah, yeah, I did. That's what they got to do. You said it's way ugly, but I said, I'll put some line. But you probably got to say, hey, that's what you got to do. It goes up for me. And nice, Ethan Salas. Padre is going to mark. Detroit, but <clears throat> first three years for him with you guys, he just can't stay healthy, right? Has a couple of monster games and then has a shoulder injury, has, you know, hamstring, growing, and then that's it. Just kind of never the same the rest of the year. I think for most people, they know DeAndre Swift is an explosive running back that can put up numbers, but the real question is going to be, is he going to be healthy all year? And I think that's why the Eagles decided to go committee-wise, you know? Keep Gainwell, right? He's on another rookie deal. Same thing as him, right? Bring in Penny for like a million. Resign Boston Scott for a million, you know? The Eagles are probably preparing just for that reason, you know? But now that, you know, Swift is on the move right now and doing well, I'm sure they're going to use him as much as they can until 
you know, an injury happens, especially with Gainwell being injured. I just think that's where the Lions traded him, you know? I think they were just fed up with it in the sense that, look, we love you, man, but we need someone that's going to be here every down, every every game, right? That's what they went to go get Jamar Gibbs, you know, with their first round pick. And I like him, so don't worry about him. I think he'll be your guys' back for the foreseeable future. Oh, you had Swift on your bench, Kev? I didn't draft him only because I didn't know how it was going to be this year because I had a feeling they were going to play Kenny Gainwell a lot and look at what happened in week one. But because he was injured this week, I had a feeling Swift could go off. Great pickup, man. Thank you. 
years. We believe that we live 100% every day. Alright, last Borgala for the Phillies. Elton. Purple for the Astros. La Verde, that's the Angel top prospect. Chris, there you go, man. Born in 2005. Still young. Nick Gonzalez. Pirates to 150. Bobby Miller. And we have a Ricardo Perez Orange Shimmer for the Phillies. Or, there you go, man. That's the last one for PR. Out of 50. Luke Berryhill. Yellow for the Astros to 75. Jeremy Port. Borgala Shimmer. Carol. And Chris Newell. Dodgers. How? Evan Diaz. Michael Tamaris. Race to 199. Rebus to 499. Pirates Big Dog. <coughs> and Eloy Jimenez. 
or you, you know, you do it a certain type of ways. Yeah. And it's really fun. And, uh, the reality is, all you gotta do is win. You know, the whole idea of having a job and then you can do something. First of all, it's the same. All right, woo. Which I think some of these guys are not affiliated with the MLB, so I'll do a randomizer for the non-MLB. We'll just give them out in one lot, and then obviously the sorting team will figure out who, what teams they go with if that's the case. But if not, it'll go to one person. Vientos. $2.99. Abrams. And Paul McIntosh. Marlins. Michael Langer. Montgomery. Galiz. Pinto. Blue Jays. Sean Madden. All right, we go two more boxes. Nice, RL Castro is a top prospect for Minnesota. Miller. Jesus Bastidas. Speckle to 299 for the Yanks. That's Matt Smith. Luis Rice. Ready for him. Dodgers Kyle. And Vargas Marco for the Marlins. No, my ball. All right, here we go, guys. Last box. Paris. What is it? Long person. Two, three, you almost had another one uh, at the end, so what was the adjustment that you got? Brian Acuna. Twins, Chris, 299. Victor is Taurus for the Guardians. Henry. Everybody's been studying us. Hold on, Javi. And Figuero for the Marlins, so far, Marlins, that's uh, Michael. Nice pray for you, buddy. Alrighty, guys, there you go. That was the break. I'll top load all the autographs right now, but a quick little recap. So you guys can see there. Alright, 24 autos, two relics there. And the Bowman Ascension. Thank you guys so much. Let me quickly switch scenes, randomize the names for any of those non MLB affiliated cards, and I'll go to one person and one lot.
<laughs> Roll. Two and a four, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Phillies, so that's going to go to Jeremy Fort. Any of those non-MLB cards will go to you, buddy. Thank you, guys. Number four is coming up next.